I'm not sure there's a skill out there as rare as asking questions. It doesn't make sense if you think about it. We don't hesitate to ask Google and Alexa anything that comes to mind, but we avoid that in front of friends, families, and coworkers for some reason. In this video, I welcome you to adopt a question-oriented mindset. Why? Because learning how to ask questions the right way will not only liberate you from making other people's opinions more important than your own happiness, it will boost your social credibility, grow your career, make you smarter, and best of all, make you feel more confident. Here's how. 1. Practice active listening. Instead of focusing on ourselves, learn about the other person their thoughts, likes, and dislikes. Your one job is to make them talk about themselves. Ask open-ended questions that can't be answered with yes or no. Every answer they give is now a piece of evidence for you to uncover your next question. Don't interrupt. Listen intently. Listen to what they say and investigate its next layer. It's like peeling off the layers of an onion. When people feel you are genuinely interested in them, it helps to build trust and thus a deeper connection. 2. Read the room. This is super important. Don't just ask questions about the next related topic as and when a question comes to mind. Rather, use questions as a springboard for a rich conversation or feedback. If by accident you turned a friendly Q&A into a slightly too personal interrogation, you need to change direction immediately and consider giving an apology. Then start over with a topic-changing question. On the other hand, if you find something to talk about that lifts the conversation and unlocks a meaningful discussion, stay there. 3. Learn new things. In a less than social situation, such as a meeting, a one-to-one -one feedback talk, or a classroom, you may find yourself asking questions to learn something new from a mentor or expert. The context may already be set if you're reviewing a topic together or they're asking for feedback. This is where it's important to craft follow-up questions that are specific, interesting, useful. For let go of your ego. If you've studied the room and reflected on the exact question you wish to ask, but you're worried that asking makes you look stupid or weak, remind yourself that by asking questions, you benefit. If you don't ask, you save your ego, but you won't get the answers you seek. Not only that, more often than not, other people in the meeting room or classroom probably have the same question as you do, but are just too shy or proud to ask. I have lost count of the times when back in my university days, whenever I asked a question, everyone else would be frantically noting down the answer. Which made me wonder why didn't anyone else raise their hands to ask if they too had the same question. By focusing on deepening your depth of knowledge with every question you ask, instead of worrying whether you look silly, you are unknowingly setting a brave and positive example for others. Keep on asking questions and never stop learning because by doing so, you have nothing to lose but everything to gain.